Hi all, welcome to the best of CAT series by IMS. This is Parmeshwar Sarma this side. Today we are going to look at an arithmetic question. So once you see the question, kindly pause the video, give it a try for let's say one or two minutes and then let's say resume the video. So in this particular question it is given that on selling a pen at 5% loss and a book at 15% gain, Kareem gains rupee 7. If he sells the pen at 5% gain and let's say book at 10% gain, the gain now becomes rupee 13. What is the cost price of the book in rupee? I will show you two approaches. The one basically will be involving equations. The other could be you can do it orally as well. So in this particular case, the objective is to find out the price of the book, the cost price of the book. So as per the first statement, can we say like this, that 7 rupee is nothing but the overall gain, which has to be nothing but the loss on uh, pen and the gain on the book. So it has to be nothing but equals to 5% of pen plus 15 percent of book. If I assume that pen represent the cost price of pen and suppose book represent the cost price of the book. So my loss on the pen will be 5 percent of pen and the gain on the book will be 15 percent of book. In the second statement is given that I am selling the pen and the book both at the profit. So my profit basically has to be 5 percent of pen and 10% of book and this thing must be equal to 13. Now since I need to find out the cost price of the book, my target basically has to be nothing but to eliminate the uh, pen part. So if I suppose ask you if you need to eliminate this two, uh, if I want to eliminate pen from these two equations, I can simply add the two equations. So if you add the two equations, one simply get 25% of the cost price of book is nothing but equals to a 20. So if 25% means a 20, can we say what does the 100% will mean? Nothing but the number 4 times and that will give you 80 as the answer. So my answer for this particular question should be option number 4 here. Now one if you carefully look at this particular question, you can notice that the loss which you get on the pen is going to get offset by the profit you get on the pen. since my loss percent and the gain percent on the pen happens to be same, both is 5% and 5%. So if you add the two profit, one simply get a 7 plus 13 equals to a 20 rupees is the total profit and that is nothing but equals to the gain obtained from the book itself, which is nothing but your 15% plus 10% giving you a 25%. So again, if 25% of the cost price of book happens to be 20, and as all of us know that 25% represent 1 by 4, so if 1 fourth correspond to a 20, 1 will correspond to nothing but 4 times of 20, giving you the number 80 as the answer. So now kindly try a similar question on the same lines and let's say kindly put the answer in the comment section.